hello guys welcome to another quick tutorial on python in this video we are going to build on our previous tutorial and show how to loop through each row of excel file using python's pandas library as you can see here in the previous example we have retrieved the data from an excel file which we got in the run terminal but one thing you can notice that the data which we have retrieved that is being saved in data frame and that complete data frame is printed here there might be some scenarios where you need to loop through each row item and perform some actions on those this row by row operations are very useful in data cleaning or analysis or any other row by row operations so let's see how we can achieve that one in pandas just to recap in the previous video we have imported the pandas and given a alias name as pd and we have defined a file path of excel and then and using the pandas function read underscore excel we have we read the excel content and stored in data frame and then uh, finally we have printed that one to achieve that one we can make use of iter rows function which is present in pandas to write that one let me remove this print function and as we are interested in getting the row by row data we can make use of row i will write for index comma row in tf dot iter rows so here to fetch each row data here we are using for loop to go through each row and the index which gives us the row in panda series containing the data for each row so when we are iterating through this this excel file using df.iter rows the data which is received in each row that will be stored here and the index of that particular row is being stored in this index variable so within this for loop let's write the print statement and in this one i will mention as index as we are getting the index we can use the open and close curly braces and within that one we can add the index then the actual row for that one within the curly braces you can mention row dot to dict so this is nothing but to dictionary this will help us to convert the row whichever we received to dictionary format which makes us to easier to read and understand so now we are iterating through each row so let's run this script now you can see we got all the rows with the index being present at the starting and the data for that particular row is being shown afterwards okay now let's say if we want to fetch only first name or last name by using this row where the data is being stored we can fetch only those particular columns for example if i want to print the last name in that case by using this row instead of converting it to do dictionary i can use the open and close square brackets and within this one i can mention the last name column so now if you run this script you can see we got only last names of each row similarly if you want to fetch the first name as well then mention the first name within this row so now if we run this script you can see we got all the first name and last name so by retrieving the specific column data which helps us making it easy to focus on that particular data while using pandas in data science or any other projects so that's it guys for this short video thanks for watching this if you like this please click on like button share it with others and subscribe to my channel